CPD for me. It's mandatory CPD, practical and relevant. This is just in the context of freehold claims. So if your client owns, whether it's their home or it's a commercial um, property, the test for the market value is the amount that a purchaser willing but not obliged to buy would pay the owner and an owner who is willing but not obliged to sell it. So it's effectively this concept is we're not looking at anxious people buying and selling and the test has come from the old, old case of um, Spencer in 1907, it's still as good law today as it ever was. And um, so it's this sort of, this. it's supposed to be this third party sort of test, you know, what would you pay if you went to sell your property on the weekend, but you weren't desperate, like the person buying it wasn't desperate to buy it. Now that creates the um, question or the statement, should I say, that nearly every client will have, which will say, well, of course I'm an anxious seller because I'm being forced to sell, so I am anxious. And of course, the acquiring authority is also an anxious purchaser because they're compelled to effectively um, put an offer to me and they're compelled to buy it. So when you have sales that proceed, you know, prior to a compulsory acquisition, so you say you've got a number of properties all in the same area, the acquiring authority start to pay, you know, two million for this house and three million for the other house or whatever the amount is, um, those cases, of, sorry, those sales don't classically fall within this definition because the, the the seller is probably anxious and the purchaser is probably anxious or possibly anxious. 